So recently I've been getting a lot of comments about my editing, whether it be through this channel or through my short form content. But what if I could tell you could make the exact same videos with features exactly like this with the use of AI. Now I've been very reluctant to make a video on AI as despite it being a trending topic, so many creators are quick to jump on it just for the views. And I've always tried to stay true to myself in creating content that I want to make and basically not follow the crowd. But for this video, unlike those that just talk about what AI you could use, this is an AI tool that I've personally been using to edit my videos that I've not really seen many people talk about and recently it's helped me step up my video quality a lot. So the website is called runwayml.com and it's specifically designed to help you with your content creation. Now immediately you'll be pleased to know that it's free but the websites will limit you with the amount of projects that you can make with this free version so for the complete version of this it currently costs $15 a month but in my opinion if you make content of any form you'll see why in a moment that the $15 will be worth it so when you go to load it up you'll find that there's a lot going on here on the home page it comes up with the most popular AI tools such as text to video where you can simply type anything you want and it will generate you footage that you can use which obviously will be copyright free because it was made out of nothing you have the same for images so for example make Maybe you're trying to get a good thumbnail for a video, but you can't seem to find an image online that fits the purpose of the thumbnail. In that scenario, this might be a good option. We have an easy remove background effect where you can mask out whatever you want by using the AI magic masking tool like this, and it'll generate it for you quite quickly without having to manually draw a sketch around the edges. All of these tools are great, but there's one in my opinion that's much better than any of these that I've started to use a lot lately. So if you go over to the projects tab and click new project, you'll see a drop down of three AI magic tools. One for motion tracking and your videos, an in painting tool, but the one I want to go through is the green screen tool. Now this editing layout is very simple. You can simply upload a video from your files and drag it into the editing timeline at the bottom. Once it's loaded, it'll automatically be set up for masking. The good thing about this is that you don't need to mask the whole object. By setting points across the object that you want to mask, it automatically identifies the whole object and will now mask out that object for the whole video. Now if the AI isn't completely accurate, you can manually refine it with the brush tool and draw the mask freehand. And to be really precise, you can zoom in as much as 400% just to really fine tune the right pixels. Once you've done that, one thing that I like to do is I go frame by frame and just clean up any areas where the AI hasn't masked it as clean as I like it. So you've got your finished green screen, you might be happy with it, but there are some additional things that you can do before exporting it. For example, you can add anything you want the timeline on the website just to see what that new video would look like over the top of it. Whether it be an image, video or a solid background. You can add in transitions, you can add a filter or a certain effect but for the sake of this video we don't need to do any of this and we just want the raw clip as a green screen video. Once exported you'll find it over in your asset where you can simply download it to your files and now you can go over to whatever you're editing on and you can add it as a layer over the top over the original clip that you used to mask. I'm using Final Cut Pro so in my case for this to work this will probably apply the same to all the other editing softwares is that you go over to effects, go down to keying and select the keyer effect. Now you'll have a layer of the original clip and a clip of the masked object on top. So now whatever you decide to add in between the two layers you'll now see in the video that it appears between the two. One thing that I found in particular that works really well with this is that you can create these seamless transitions between videos where the object in the foreground is still showing as you then bring in the next video as part of the green screen. How I do this is that I mask out the section of the video that I want it to be a green screen. For example this plain window. Then when you add it over the top of the original layer you want to make sure that it covers over both of the clips that you're using. Then you can add in a cross dissolve or whatever transition that you want underneath. With this AI tool you can experiment with whatever you like. I'm still testing out the capabilities of it myself but I think this just brings that extra bit of quality to your videos without actually having to own a green screen. And like I said you can utilize this for any type of content. For example I've used this on my recent video on my channel. I've also been using this over on my Instagram and every video that I've made where I've spent a bit longer to edit by using this it's majorly got better interaction. So if you are creating content you can try this for free and if you like it you can pay the $15 a month like me as unfortunately this isn't a sponsorship but I wouldn't be making this video if I genuinely didn't like it and I wasn't using it myself. If you feel like you're struggling to get the recognition that you deserve for the content that you make and you feel like you're just wasting your time getting limited results I want you to check out this video as it might just be your next upload that changes everything.